The holidays are coming, and with some safety precautions in place, we're hoping to be able to celebrate with our friends and family. That means lots of yummy food, additional visitors, and plenty of opportunities for your pup to exhibit poor behaviors. Hi, I'm Jamie Popper, a certified professional dog trainer at Blue Nine Pet Products, and I'm excited to be bringing you this holiday training mini series. We're going to be working on teaching our dogs to have some polite manners so that this holiday season is stress-free and safe for your pet. Leave It is our next exercise in our Holiday Manners mini series. Leave It can be a life-saving cue for our pets. If we drop food or medication that we don't want them to eat, we need to have a cue that says, leave that alone. With the holidays coming up, that means lots more opportunities for your dog to steal food off of the countertops or pick up dropped food from any of your guests. We'll want to teach our dogs how to leave that food or any other dropped items alone. Our first step in teaching that leave it cue is asking our dogs to get up on the climb. By having them on an elevated surface, it helps increase their impulse control, which means they'll learn the skill just that much faster. From there, we're going to present a cookie in our hand in front of our dog's nose. We'll cue them to leave it. As soon as they turn their head away from the cookie in our hand, we're going to mark and reinforce with another cookie. Eventually, we'll work up to dropping the food or the treat onto the ground and asking our dogs to leave it from there as well. So let's get started with our demo dog, Peek, the Australian Coolie. All right, to start, I'm gonna take one cookie. This is my leave it cookie. I'm never going to let my dog have this cookie inside of this session. Um, and what I'm gonna do is put it in my hand and present it to my dog. I'm gonna make sure that I've got a ha small handful of cookies at the ready to reinforce my dog when they do the behavior I'm looking for. I'm gonna go ahead and present the cookie to my dog and tell her to leave it. As soon as she turns her head away from it, I'm gonna go ahead and mark and reinforce her for that. Leave it, yes. Leave it, yes. Even if her head turn away from it is not super obvious, we can mark and reinforce the absence of the behavior as well. As long as she's not trying to steal it, we can go ahead and reinforce her for that behavior. Leave it. Yes. She had a little bit of trouble with that one because I presented it a little bit closer to her. So you may have noticed that I closed my hand around it to make sure that she didn't steal it. If she does accidentally steal the cookie inside of this training session, what she'll learn is that leave it means I can have it if I get there fast enough. And that's when you'll end up having a dog that eats really quickly or tries to steal the cookie. We wanna make sure that that doesn't happen. Leave it. Yes. Very nice. Once we've done a few repetitions with the cookie in our hand and we're not having to close our hand around it as much, we can start to work on putting it on the floor. So I may drop it from a low height, leave it, reinforce my dog for hanging out up on their climb and ignoring that cookie. We'll reset and practice that a couple more times. Leave it, good. Leave it. Yes, very nice, very nice. Over time, you're going to work on dropping higher value pieces of food. So you can try something like a stinkier training treat or a piece of cheese that your dog might be really excited about. Then work on doing this in real life situations as well. Like when you're cooking in the kitchen, you could practice dropping something that your dog might be interested in. That would be safe if they did accidentally steal it, but you'll be at the ready to reinforce them for the appropriate behavior of leaving it alone. Good job, very nice. Thanks for joining us for our Holiday Manners mini-series. We hope your pup has learned some proper etiquette through this training series. If you're looking for more training tips, check out the Learn section at www.blue-9.com. See you there!